But what was the greatest economic bomb ever dropped on us that caused this? Put it in chat if you know, and I'll give you a few seconds. For my people in LA and Chicago, you already know. Redlining. Redlining was the 9-11 of our financial freedom. Please write that down. So redlining were covenants and agreements that banned the sale of homes to certain neighborhoods, excuse me, of neighborhoods, certain racial groups, i.e. us. So 80% of uh, neighborhoods, according to a 1937 uh, magazine article, reported that 80% of the neighborhoods in Chicago and Los Angeles were restricted by these covenants in 1940. And it was the number one factor that eliminated our wealth in this country. You often hear me tell my son in a market, green means up and red means down. But here's the origin of this phrase. It comes from redlining and it applies to the stock market. If you listen, there are hidden codes throughout every business that originate in, in slavery that we told you about in episode 70. And this is one of them. So the maps are color coded to let you know which areas were for us and which ones were not. So the green areas represented demand up and coming neighborhood where, prof where professional men lived that were polished, well-groomed, well-to-do, good for society, AKA not us. Red were areas of infiltration that had already occurred where more Latino and black people would be. And these homes and these neighborhoods had a lower value as a result. And unfortunately, black households have nearly 57% of their net worth tied to the value of their homes, while Hispanic homeowners carry about 67% of their wealth. And as a shared net worth, um, those that are white have only 41% tied to their houses. The rest are made up in business, real estate, investing in the market and life insurance. And we're behind in all of those categories. So when I tell you tonight, this information is as important as investing. They are brother and sister, Siamese twins that should be paired together. Because not only are we behind in investing, but we are also behind in real estate.